Hey, 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 it's Mike Duffy checking in from, uh, let's see if Instagram worked or not. There we go. That's Perfect. Okay. Saturday night, 9, 10 p.m. Moncton Standard Time, 30th, 2023. One more day of uh, 2023 left, and then Happy New Year. We're into 2024. And my timeline of uh, leaving is getting shorter and shorter and shorter, which is interesting. <laughs> anyway, um, I worked this morning and took one of my trainees with me, and he told me my job's easy. So that is so I'm at some confidence. I'm happy with that. We just need to uh, turn that confidence into uh, um full-time marketing and sales right so i he's got a whole box full of door hangers to go hand out in his community and he'll i've posted a couple pictures of the front and back of my new business cards we'll be handing those out in dubai he'll be handing them out on my behalf when he's in calgary so um also getting toolboxes ready for the my two replacements my two fill-ins my two backups so give them some don't get hacked branded stuff give them some tools just to get started and we'll see how um they take care of everything when i'm gone for a month but uh yeah so it's saturday hope you all had a good weekend hope you're planning out stuff for 2024 getting rest if you need that goal setting for 2024 all the stuff you need to get ready for 2024 i hope you've accomplished something in the past week towards getting ready for 2024 um I've been editing, so I've posted that I've been editing, and I've got a ton of episodes still to get through. Um, completely frustrated with editing today, just completely frustrated with it. Some interviews are like um, the business speed dating interviews, likely have three, four seasons of content to go through. Um, we know one interview did not record any audio. Don't know how that happened. I knew that months ago. Um, but as I'm working through stuff, like initial glimpses of the interviews, everything looks fine until you start going through and editing it. So the other day I was going through a bunch of episodes really quickly, did not have any video or audio freezes or flaws, and uh, flew through a couple episodes really quick. And then last night slash today just kind of grinded to a halt. Um, some interviews have been in like eight minutes. I know I've got some 40-minute interviews in there. Today, well, last night I started on a 20-minute episode, and I knew I had some audio delays. I don't know why. Uh, the video captured properly, the audio captured properly, but there is a delay. Um, there's this delay that's not always there, but, of course, it's... <laughs> There's a lot of laughter in this interview, and I don't know if that caused the audio video synchronization issues, but boy, does that stuff drive you crazy when you're editing. Um, of course, if we just did audio podcasts, it wouldn't really matter. There wouldn't be any editing because I could just like cut out the video and just do audio. But since I've done video and audio, you kind of want things synced properly, at least to the point where, where there's somebody's mouth is moving. You think there should be words lined up with that movement anyway i got through it 9 p.m tonight i started the last night or at least set up the timeline of the video in the editor and then about two or three minutes into editing i realized i had to take the video clip out separately go edit it and that took about five hours today just because it was super frustrating super frustrating and i just couldn't seem to get a good the audio and the the audio and the video for like a minute or two would be in sync and then we'd start laughing and then it wasn't in sync anymore <laughs> she's gonna find it hilarious because she's hilarious and but anyway we laughed so much the audio kept getting out of sync i don't know why maybe the computer was freezing maybe the sound i have no idea why the audio is particularly out of sync but this one interview 21 minutes I try to laugh on it Anyway, really frustrating to edit because, of course, you want to 
Um, it just looks weird when your lips are out of sync with the audio. I know bad foreign dubs. You put up with that stuff. But my quality as a producer, I want it to look... I want to present this both in the best light as possible. So anyway, that's how editing goes. It's like learning any new skill, right? It's just effort, effort, effort. And then you know what to watch out for in the future because we're professionals and we get better with experience. And of course you need the 10,000, no, 10,000 hours to become an expert in one particular subject. So the easy answer is record shorter interviews, but is that really a good answer? Or you need to get your tech stack streamlined as good as much as possible to make sure everything's synchronized. So it's done. Getting getting through season two and season three right now. So anyway, have a good night. It's uh happy new years. Um, I will definitely live stream tomorrow. But tomorrow's gonna be all day editing because our time frame is down to like 16 days or something like that. What is it now? 16 days, I think. 16 days, 16 days. We leave on a Monday and tomorrow Sunday. So we really have two weekends. Um, this is our third weekend left that we have, and then when it's over, there's two weekends left, and then we're gone for a month. Anyway, have a good night and happy new years. If I don't if you don't hear from me. You see my uh, anyway. Happy New Year's! I'll, I'll I'll post tomorrow. Um, I'll try to do it in the morning, but I'm not frustrated with video editing. So we'll see if we can. Uh, Nine seventeen p.m. Let's see if I can get one episode, another episode. Uh, hoping the next episode is really easy to edit, and it's not uh, like five hour crunch to do a twenty minute video. It should not take that long with editing, but sometimes you have tech issues, and sometimes things aren't going to go as smooth as you plan. Um, service call this morning went really smooth. Two and a half hours in and out, and almost fully rewired a network rack, but I think there's more work to do there. And uh, I told the new customer and his wife that I think we should do more, but, you know, they were kind of dead with me after two and a half hours of rewiring it and showing all the bad wiring that both the shop home builder did we cleaned up a lot. Two of us, we cleaned up a lot this morning. Anyway, have a good night. And uh, yeah, I was a little bit exhausted from.